all right uh, so now we have uh, one cart item for this user okay uh, if, you, if you see here we have one cart item for this ratan.kumar492 user right so but uh, uh, this this is still the, the counter is still showing zero and uh, it is uh, the shopping cart is still empty right so we need to fix those uh, uh, those two things uh, in this video all right so this uh, counter is actually from the context processors okay so now if i go to this uh, here and inside the cards and context processors we have a, a counter uh, you know counter function all right so in here uh, what we are doing we are actually uh, make in the try block we are actually uh, uh, you know taking the cart uh, by the cart id right so what i'll do i'll just uh, I in after this one i'll just uh, uh, make a condition that if request user is authenticated then that means the user is any user is logged in then uh, give me the count of the cart items for that particular user okay not uh, based on the cart id right so that's why so let me just say request dot a user dot is authenticated okay. I'll say cart items cart items dot objects okay so what i'll do i'll just paste this and paste this cart items cart item dot objects dot all filter now instead of this cart equals cart user equal to request dot user dot user okay so if he is not logged in that is else then this code will run okay card items will be this card card equal to card of you know this this is actually uh, give, even if you have uh, so many card uh, card ids it will give you only one card id okay that's why it is, uh, it is like this uh and now this should be this should be fine okay Fish. now you can see only uh, i mean one uh, card item one uh, in the uh, counter but this one is still not working so we will fix that as well now go to the cart dot uh, you know cart view card item so this is the cart okay so in this cart we are actually uh, you know uh, cart equal to based on the cart id we are the same thing we are doing right based on the cart id we are getting the cart and based on this cart we are getting the cart items okay this cart item we are getting but the but for the authenticated users it will be different right okay so the same thing uh, we'll uh, uh, check for if the user is authenticated or not right so here if uh, request dot user dot is authenticated so the query will be different now so that is uh, okay copy and paste it here art items equal to art item dot object filter so instead of this cart we will say user equals request dot user okay and this is active equal to true all right so in the else case in the else case we will put these two lines here all right so just giving me the cart id and based on the cart id it is uh, giving you the cart items okay so this is for non-logged in users this is for logged in users okay so for the lo logged in users we have uh, this much cart items and we are looking through the cart item in cart item so everything else is same all right so now if i go to here and refresh now you can see one cart item is uh, added okay so this is how it works and uh, this plus buttons and minus buttons and all these remove button i think remove is okay so this remove is also not working okay we will uh, only a few few changes to all these functions then it will start working all right so once again i will log out and i will just uh, add any product and video and now this is added okay, i'll add two uh, two products and medium okay so now we have added two products 
checkout login now you can see three products we have because one product already we had in the uh, we had for this particular user and uh, two products it came from the logged out user okay so this is how it works and uh, the next thing is now you can see uh, white and medium and green and large blue and medium right so now uh, there is one problem now if i add blue and medium again okay so now i'm logged out and uh, i'll i'll take this blue and medium from here and i'll go to login now it is added but the problem is blue and medium is not grouped right so this blue, blue and medium here and this blue and medium here so this should actually uh, group okay so so this grouping we have to take care of also all right so and this plus and mi minus button so that's not a problem we'll fix that very easily and uh, and yeah so uh, uh, this grouping we'll do in the next one all right thank you